hello guys i haven't been posting for a while so i guess we'll talk about that today and um yeah i just i've been feeling like really depressed or whatever and i've been i don't know ever since i don't know i just i've been doing a lot of errands okay um i don't know <laughs> i'm just like so depressed i can't even make videos Oh, and look, I got fake eyelashes. I probably will not get them again unless they're, like, very, very light because, I don't know, they're, like, volume, they're thick, and they're bugging my eyes. And they actually, they impair my vision. Like, when I'm driving, I just see my lashes. So I'm, like, ugh. They irritate me, especially at night when I'm, not, like, trying to go to bed. I'm just, like, trying to, like, mess with them. Then I got my nails done, and I also got my toes done. <laughs> oh. Okay, but right now, um, I was gonna send out a package. And I'm sorry if you hear the air blowing, I'm in Texas, so it's very hot, obviously. You see how hot I am? Do I look like, I look flustered, I feel like, in this video. Okay, but anyways, I'm sending out a package to my boyfriend. I'm gonna show you guys a little bit because it's his birthday next month, so I'm sending it right now. Uh, I decorated it and it looks like girly, but look, it's so cute. It says happy birthday. I had to like figure out how to like put these things on so that they would like stay facing front instead of turning. And then right here it says like his age. I don't know, it's just like, I bedazzled the sides a bit, I don't know if you can see it, and then I just put some stickers over here. So yeah, all I got him was some socks, some skincare, some snacks, like barely any snacks, because there's not a lot that I could fit in like, the large, um, what's it called, priority flat rate, and then I wrote him like a little note, um, whatever, so now... I have to tape that up. I think it's cute. Oh my god. <laughs> I hope he doesn't like rip it open or else it's just gonna break. I mean, that's fine, but. Oh my god, I have to tape this. Okay. He won't see it on this video. I mean, usually he'll watch my YouTube videos once I post them. <laughs> But since he can't do that, like he won't get the notification right away, then it's okay to like show you guys. By the way, I didn't even tell you why I'm, did I tell you why I'm sending him a package? I mean, he's deployed. <laughs> I mean, why else would I be sending him? Well, actually, if you're like in a long distance relationship, even if it's not like military, then it's, it's nice to still send gifts, you know? like. I hope long distance relationship people still do that, you know, instead of just like talking and video chatting, you could actually send gifts. Mm -hmm. Wait, did I put everything in there? I hope I'm not putting too much tape because then I, don't know. I told him to open it on one side. So we'll see. Then I'm going to the post office to give them the customs form so they can like, um, they put like, uh, what is it called? They put it into like a little seal so it, you know, it'll stay fresh. And I was supposed to go to a pole class today also guys, but I didn't go because I went to go eat with my mom. Um, yeah, so I had to cancel my class and it wasn't like I'm gonna be on the pole but it's like a class to get pole strength like flexibility and then core strength which I really want to do I just I don't know I like those classes because they do require strength and I do want to have a lot more strength in my body okay but now anyways I'm gonna drive and go to the post office <laughs> hey guys so it's the next day don't I look different I I look so weird Oh my god, I look so weird. I don't know. I just got out of yoga and I was trying this mat that the 
this yoga mat that this company sent me from Amazon because my yoga it's like 90 degrees in there I got a black swan yoga um, yeah uh, <laughs> but anyways like I'm always like slipping on my mat like I just bought a new mat and I was slipping on there I couldn't really hold some poses but this one I'm like trying out I just tried it out for the first time but I think I need to try it out a little bit more um, anyways if you guys want to go to yoga if you live in like Denver Austin I think they have it in Houston I think they have it in Dallas they have it in San Antonio it's called black swan yoga they're like donation based I would say they're the best yoga place they have a nice yoga studio it's affordable to everybody like everybody um you know since you could give them the amount that you want oh my god there's a chunk of um parking right by me <laughs> okay it's probably construction oh well let's just um move on but anyways the yoga mat that they sent me came with this yoga strap but i don't really use yoga straps i guess if you're carrying like a lot of stuff but you know there's really no reason especially if i'm in a rush you know i don't have time to be putting the mat onto the yoga straps because um it takes it takes a little while you know well i mean for me because you know you gotta loosen it then put it wrap it around kind of and then just tighten it. I mean, this one's easy. But what I'm saying is I could just roll it up and tuck it under my arm. Okay, anyways, I hope these people are not looking at me right next to me. Um, I did want to share with you this bag. You know, since I've been depressed or whatever, and I haven't been making videos, I've been staying at my sister's, well, my mom's. I just, I've been staying with my mom a lot, even though I haven't been hanging out with her because she works a lot. Um, oh my god, they're right there. Act natural. <laughs> okay, but anyways. Um, okay, I've been staying at my mom's. So I just like use this duffel bag to uh, go over there. Because I pack my kids' clothes in here. I pack my clothes in here. Um, and I don't know, I like it. Because it has like a lot of pockets. I even bring my yoga mat with it because this strap on top you can I can like put my yoga mat just on top of the bag and then just tighten it like that um it's also removable which I don't need it right now so it's just like velcro you just take it off and then this bag has like a longer strap and um shorter straps but this one is from Bagsmart they sent me it to try out and review and I honestly love it. Like, it's so versatile and I can carry a lot of stuff. It has, like, pockets on each side on the outside. And then it has one pocket on the side on the outside. And then on the inside, it's just, like, big. And then it has a zipper pocket right here. And then it has a pocket on the... I don't know how to show you. As you can see, it has, like, a pocket on the side up here. And then along the side, along the other side, it has like a huge pocket where I could carry my computer. I think I've put my computer in here before. But I can carry my computer in this huge pocket and then put little things in here. Like usually I'll put like toiletries, like little, like my shaver or whatnot. Um, and then my face moisturizer and stuff. And then, you know, I'll like separate stuff into all the little pockets. And I really love this bag. I like love the texture. I don't know how to describe it. It seems just like very texturous. <laughs> I'm like making up a word. But it's so nice. It's like the pink duffel bag. Um, I'll put the links and everything down below. But I would recommend this. They also have like a backpack. But I'm not really a backpack girl. You know? And this, like this duffel bag, it can carry a lot. It's not like those... Um, Victoria's Secret pink duffel bags. Those are the worst. Even their backpacks, you know, they don't have a lot of pockets. And, you know, it's like, why would you want to buy a bag that doesn't have a pocket inside? Unless you're going to carry a little, like, a little, I don't know, just like little stuff. Like my purse, my purse, it's just, boom, it doesn't have any pockets in there. So everything's shoved in there. And I always have to dig around. So. 
Yeah, it would be nice to have um, some pockets. Oh my gosh, those people are still there, and I think they're looking at me, and I don't know what they're saying. Okay, but anyways, yes, I will put all the duffel bag information down below. And also, if you're feeling depressed like me, um, I would say try yoga. Like, I feel like yoga makes you feel much better. Oh my god, there's somebody else right here, but you can't care about what anybody thinks. I, I don't know why I keep drinking water whenever I notice someone or, I don't know. Uh, okay, um, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, yoga's nice, um, okay, like I scheduled it last minute, which I usually do, like if I'm in a bad mood and I don't want to do anything, then I will schedule yoga last minute, I'll be like, oh, there's a class, I'm gonna schedule it, and I'll schedule it like 20 minutes before, or, or I will drive to the yoga class. And then I'll schedule it and then go inside. <laughs> you know, um, but anyways. Or, I mean, right now we have to schedule it, but usually before I would just, like, go show up, like, right before it starts. And then just go inside. But this one, I could have scheduled it later, but I scheduled it now because of the teacher. For the San Antonio location, I think my favorite teacher is Sybil. I think I tried like four of the yoga teachers, but I don't know. I like Sybil's flow because they all have different flows. Do y'all hear that music? I hope it doesn't get me like copyrighted. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so they just left, thank God, because um, YouTube will demonetize you for like so many things. Like most of my videos are demonetized, so that's why I don't really make money. Um, yeah, but anyways, I did get my first YouTube paycheck last month. It was $149. It took me quite a few months to make that because, well, I mean, obviously most of my videos are demonetized because of, like, the bikinis and stuff. You can't turn around and show your butt or anything. Um, well, it depends. It just depends on what they think because on some of them, it's like they... Some of them that show my butt, they are monetized. Well, barely any, like maybe like one or two. And then the others are demonetized. And then my leggings video is demonetized, which I don't know why. Maybe because I went up to the front of the camera, but I don't see how any of that is wrong. Like, I'm trying to show detail, texture, like what's going on. Um, but yeah, anyways. Uh... So, I did pick up a new medication today. It's Celexa. I forgot. I don't know what the, like, the medical name is. But I've tried so many other medications for my depression. I've tried Mirtzapine, Prozac. Prozac was the worst, okay? I always, like, I always listen. Like, whenever I'm watching movies, I always hear Prozac. And that, that medicine is just the absolute worst. And then, they, and then I tried Sertraline. I think it's Sertraline. And then Trazid Trazodone. Um, yeah, so hopefully this one works this time. But anyways, I think I'm just gonna go home and edit this video. This was just kind of like an update. And obviously, I'm not posting to OnlyFans this week because I am on my period. And thanks to Hi O, which is like, um, which is, which are the reusable period pads. That's what I'm using right now. Thank God kept me safe but I don't know I just you know we had to open our legs so many times in yoga you know get those deep stretches so I was like so worried um but anyways yeah I don't know I don't, I don't know there's not really much to update you guys on just that I got paid from YouTube hopefully I get paid this month but I haven't been posting I'm at $95 and the threshold is $100 so I need to make five more dollars or else I'm not getting paid. Um, I also quit my job that I had before before quarantine. You know, I quit it during quarantine because it didn't work much. And I, even if I did work, I only worked a 
week out of the day and I didn't make that much so now I'm just like relying on OnlyFans and OnlyFans I've been making more than I do at my job and I don't have to like personally go in but um it's just like I've been feeling so down and not I haven't been wanting to like take pictures or make videos so that's how I lose some of my subscribers because I found a secret forum online like sometimes I'll search my name okay just to see if people are putting stuff out there because you know people will leak your stuff no matter how small you are people will leak your stuff so I looked up myself and then I found a forum and then they said that they didn't resubscribe because I wasn't consistent which is good I mean nobody tells me that like on my page but that was good advice like I'm glad that I found that forum and then I also found that other people were like leaking my videos which oh I don't know it doesn't really bother me yeah people have to pay like for my only fans and you know I guess you you could get your leaked videos taken down but I like it doesn't bother me I know people worry about that because they're worried about who's gonna see it you know but at this point in my life you know I used to be worried about that like especially on all the movies you know a girl sends out a nude and then it ruins her life and then you know it leads to whatever um but yeah I don't really care about that anymore because you know it doesn't matter what people think oh people are gonna say things on the internet okay you could just literally turn off your phone and you don't have to deal with any of it like even if it if they're like telling you stuff from in real life you know just ignore it and even if you can't ignore it like you honestly shouldn't care what other people think I mean some people take that too far where they're like rude and they don't care what people think I'm talking about being yourself and not caring about what people think you know being a good person <laughs> okay but anyways I'm gonna go home so I guess that's the end of this video I'm gonna post the bag down below okay bag smart this is my favorite bag you know what is this my this is my only bag well I mean I have my purse but I love using this bag for everything now thank God especially um, for traveling this is the bomb okay obviously <laughs> so I'm gonna use that whenever I travel hopefully hopefully at the beginning of next year or uh, before the end of this year because I feel like well we could talk about that in another video but anyways yes um, I'm gonna say bye <laughs> and if I were you I wouldn't get fake lashes unless they're like very very thin I feel like these are thin enough but okay but anyways yes bye guys I hope you have a great day a great night and just remember to try and stay positive try like try to do something you know do two jumping jacks you know help you get some energy <laughs> okay but anyways bye guys i gotta go home. i gotta go home okay